Uh, essentially, what we focus on is understanding every pixel and every point in the world in three-dimensional space over time. So, you know, that's a lot of things to digest, uh, but think of uh, all of the sensors that you have on a robot or an autonomous vehicle, LIDARs, cameras, radars, sonars, etc. And you need to make sense of all of this data coming in. And so our technology enables understanding every single pixel at almost a millimeter level of like this is part of a human, this is part of a road, this is part of a street, and so on. Typical customers are car OEMs, tier one suppliers, mapping companies, sensor makers, and autonomous full stack developers. So some of our customers are Daimler Mercedes, Samsung, uh, Neuro, they do an autonomous delivery robot. And, and then we have a lot of others in the trucking as well as in the mapping and uh, LiDAR space. So for example, Quanergy is a customer of ours. Ouster is also a customer, they do LiDARs. On the trucking, Starsky Robotics is one of our customers. And on the autonomous stack, uh, AutoX and Pony AI, uh, they're also customers of Deepin. So I worked at Google and I've seen a lot of what what's now called Waymo. I've seen it in the early days when it was trying to do their own car and you know testing in the parking lots and whatnot. And I think it comes down to foundations. The mobility of things and people is a really, really big problem. When, when, I really, when autonomy really clicked for me, uh, my car was at the, at the shop and I had to drop off my daughter to school in the morning in an Uber. Uh, that 15 minutes in the Uber that I spent with my daughter, not looking at my phone, not doing anything else other than having a conversation with her in the morning. And you know, I'm not instructing her or telling her what to do or do your homework or teaching her something. It's just us talking. Uh, that's what autonomy is for me. It's just time to do the things that I care about. Kind of our focus is this uh, four-dimensional data, is uh, time sequences of multi-sensor data. So not just one snapshot, but over thousands of frames or hours of driving. You know, as we show and inspire people, it's like here's what you can do with this. It can open up a lot of doors in, in autonomy, robotics, as well as things like augmented reality, medical, and other fields.